Eight years ago, a woman drove her car through the crowd at Oklahoma State's homecoming parade in Stillwater, killing four people. Dozens of others were also hurt, most of them children. News on Six's Cal Day tells us how the community was changed and how the university is remembering the victims. Homecoming week is usually a big celebration at every university, but those who have seen it in Stillwater will tell you nobody does it quite like Oklahoma State. Every year we have uh, 80, 90, 100,000 alumni and friends that come to Stillwater. We have a week long of activities. But at OSU, homecoming now brings a sad reminder of the horrific incident that killed four parade spectators in 2015. Dr. Ann Kane is the president of the OSU Alumni Association. She was among the thousands on campus that day for what was supposed to be another great homecoming weekend. Started seeing all the helicopters flying and we thought, oh wow, there's been a bad accident on 412 or something and then come to find out the tragedy happened. That tragedy forever changed the lives of many people, especially the victims and their families. You think of Dr. Stone and a longtime professor, OSU alum, his wife, longtime OSU employee, and then little two-year-old Nash, and then Nikita, who was a student at UCO. Kane says that day also changed the campus and the entire town. It just cast this, this pall over the whole celebration of homecoming, right? Saturday is supposed to be the culminating event um, and the ball game that day. I can't even remember now who we played, did we win, because your heart just wasn't in it. Following the tragedy, donors gave money to build this memorial to remember the victims. And Stillwater now takes more steps to enhance security, including more barriers as a way to keep people safe at what's known as America's greatest homecoming. The homecoming parade once again is scheduled for 9 o'clock this Saturday in Stillwater. Organizers say there will be a banner with the word Stillwater Strong to honor those four lives taken eight years ago. In Stillwater, Cal Day, Oklahoma's own is on six.